What is up guys and welcome back to my channel and today we are on to the next episode of my Rugby Challenge 3 7 series with Scotland and today we are into a new tournament and it's the Argentina tournament and pretty much the teams we've got in our group are England, Fiji and Kenya and I just want to apologise for the start before it goes on anymore obviously I have scored just there so it's a great start for us um, but the footage was a bit corrupted so you'll see like massive gaps in it and at the end you'll see something else happens as well but yeah sorry about that I don't know what's going on with my Elgato at the moment but yeah so you see to start off with 14-0 lead great start for us they kick long here it's really hard to see this but actually it literally looks like it's going to go dead and they do touch it down they do score so that was a bit gutting um, but just before half time here England are able to go in again and it's going to make it 14 all at half time and pretty much we just needed to get a few tries in the second half and we could win the game and Hogg does get the ball on the wing and you see all this choppy footage and he is able to go in under the post I'm sorry about this already but that's, that's the way it goes sometimes and you see again a little bit of running around in circles, nice pass, nice offload and surely he's in, he's getting closer, gets tackled, we rock over, get the ball and we are able to score on the left hand side. So beating England and all we have to do is just seal it out now, there's not much time for them but they do score again but they do not have enough time to play now. So. We do win our first game against England in our first match, so that's, that's a good start for us. And now our next game is against Kenya. You see Kenya. Obviously we did play them in the last tournament in Australia, but hopefully we can do better this time. But it doesn't start very well here. We do get the ball, going out of play, throw it back in field and it does get turned over. So that's a bit gutting and they do score straight away. So not a good start for us. You see here, they do go wide. They have loads of numbers and they are able to go in in the corner. Again, choppy footage. I can't apologise more for it because I, I I can't change it. I've even tried to render the video before I do this and it still hasn't changed it. So I'm a bit gutted about that. Um, but but yeah we see we are we are down but we do get a chance here with Henry and he is able to go in and score so that is helping us out a little bit getting us a bit back into it but you see they do get a yellow card which is good for us and you see Hoggy here gets the ball we're going to kick the touch no quick tap chip over the fullback we'll chip over just the line and we do score but in this game I was struggling to get my kicks and actually they did actually get a drop kick here. Obviously we didn't see it but they got a drop kick. But here we did get the ball on their five and Hoggy just go in in the corner. So yet again we're winning which is brilliant. But Kenya here they gave us a good fight in this game. And we missed that tackle I don't know how I just went through him. And they give it out wide and we do just tackle him. Surely we should have turned that over, we didn't. But then, they get the ball, they go blind, fend off one, back inside, a huge miss pass, and they do score underneath the post. So again, they are up here, 24-17, and we, we, if we win this game, we qualify for the Cup, so that'll be the first time. We need to win this. We do go down the sideline, get it back in field, and we do score. And that does even it up after that. So now with the game even we need to get one more try just to put us ahead and with a long ball here you see we do get the ball we are able just to outpace him and then I think that's Henry again he, he is able to go in for another try and that's the way the game's going to finish as well. So pretty much good win only just beating Kenya but that's very good for us but actually you see we do actually score one more try here little grubber through hacks it on and hacks it on and then does dive on it here so that's another try for us but that was going to be the last try of the game 
and a good win. So beaten, beaten Kenya, good result for us. Uh, we need now to hopefully get that last win and it's against Fiji which is if you saw in the first episode of the series we lost 72 20 something so this was going to be a tough game but we really need to get a win and you see Fiji they do start well they get the ball and they do score on the left see choppy footage I'm sorry um, but here we do get the line up we get the ball we pass it wide and Hoggy does go in in the corner so that's another good try for us in this episode and you see straight from this kickoff we are able to ooh, it's choppy as always pretty much from this kickoff we are able to regather it and we do do some good work oh it's just awful isn't it I apologize even more Henry does get the kickoff we do get it and we play the ball wide and there's so much space we do go wide he's covering very very well but we do get the ball back inside and we do score and here you see this very very choppy I can't believe how choppy it is and well, yet again we do regain, regain the kickoff and we go through the line and we do score straight from it so that's great for us and we are up and that's at half time 21-7 so we're on the way to beating Fiji for the first time ever and with another kickoff we are able to regather it no we're not because they actually get the ball and they do run the length and that does make it much closer and now they're within seven so they could potentially get this back now but here is the part where I've been dreading and it's that you see here, we do go wide, do go sort of round him, and we are just about to score, and my footage goes. And the result of this game, we did actually beat Fiji, and we do go into the Cup semi-finals against South Africa. So hopefully that will be in the next episode, but if you guys have enjoyed, please do leave a like. I'm very sorry about the choppy footage and stuff, I need to sort out my Ogato, maybe update it or something. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode, hopefully with better quality. Sorry. Bye, guys.